morning guys welcome back to another trucking vlog uh we are getting ready to roll out here um it's noon um but we got our next plan load and it doesn't pick up till tomorrow so not really too big of a hurry um because it's it's a relay and then it's a relay in uh, petro which sucks <laughs> but uh we're headed out here now um hopefully it goes by pretty fast um it's a live unload so fingers crossed for that as well luckily though um our next load is in joliet illinois and it's at a cfi yard apparently so because i know we're going to be in chicago here around six so that gives us somewhere to park at least you know I don't know how far that is away from where I'm headed but I should be able to make it there today I, I mean we're only driving 300 miles this morning so I'm not I'm guessing that Joliet's closer than 300 miles from Chicago and then we'll have to sit there till tomorrow morning and then we uh, we're pre planning they're doing good again I'm hoping I'm hoping this is a good sign but yeah, me pre-planned out of Joliet, a 400-mile trip, and then after that, they got me picking up in Ohio, which, granted, I don't really want to be coming back to Iowa, but that's what the uh, pre-plan is, is to pick up in Ohio and come back to uh, Iowa, and that's about 780 miles, which is good. So, yeah, I don't know what it was, but the night before I had my truck set on 60 we gotta set this to auto had my truck set on 60 and it was steaming cold or not steaming cold it was freezing cold when I woke up yesterday so I had it set on like 68 last night and I woke up and it was felt like it was 80 this morning in here all right guys we're about an hour away from our delivery but we're gonna stop here at this loves uh, make us a sandwich and eat some chips because uh, we haven't ate anything. We had a little bit of gum earlier, but uh, I'm gonna stop here. I don't know, I might, I probably should like stop in uh, Fuel Island and wipe off my windshield and stuff. Is that gonna give us the green light? I hope it is, good, awesome. But uh, hope you guys are having a fantastic day like always. Um, this loves is supposed to be pretty new, so we'll have to check her out. My GPS is like, where are you going? Where are you going? I'm like, eh. Just to the little loves right here. I need this outside lane. I think never good to take the inside lane in a semi so we probably need this outside one here can we get that green turn light why is that guy stopped at that light what the heck why don't we have a green uh, must have just went red or something I'll tell you guys what nothing hits harder than a ham and cheese sandwich with some chips on it <laughs> it's so good dude that's it's literally been what I've been eating like I just went through uh, a bag through sour cream and onion ruffles uh, and I was like putting them on my sandwich and they were so good but we gotta go 35 miles here we're gonna stop at this loves because the air system here was down and I need to get my tires inflated so it's only 35 miles so we should be able to get that done there and then uh, get in there around 7 I'd say with Chicago traffic and uh, yeah all right guys so we're backing into this door between 45 and 55 um, and then we got to sit inside which sucks but that's the rule here so be nice if this truck here on the what wasn't here on the end i'm actually gonna let this box truck guy go if he pulls out here in a minute uh he's 
getting in right now. I'm gonna let him go, so just a second. Uh, I guess we're gonna try to go in while we wait. So we're gonna go for door 52 here. So we're gonna cut it up to the right. This is not gonna be any fun. I don't think we're lined up very good. <laughs> it's hard to tell with no lines, dude. Actually, we may have been okay there. Left and right. Pull up to the left a little bit. I'm gonna go right. We're at an angle, just a tiny one. We're gonna have to get out and check. I think we're still at an angle here. I'm guessing that this line's straight with the building. So, uh, yeah, hold on. We're gonna go with that and think that that line's straight. So we need to... We actually need to push it the other way. I don't know what I was doing there. And there's no idling here either, so we're gonna have to shut the truck off. Now I need to go hard left. Well, we're more straight with that line there, but I need to ease it back over that way just a little bit more. These ones are so small too, so it's like so hard to tell. <sighs> I'm struggling here, guys. If this was a blind side, that'd be a lot worse. I'm telling you that right now. So you can see we're at an angle, but I'm trying to get it to travel over a little bit here. And then we'll cut it back in. I don't know, dude. I get, let me just bump it. That way I get all the room I need. Well. like this uh, we can't even like hold on. this is what we need to do here okay Garmin cancel navigation It's literally the same. What is going on? Maybe that's better. Okay, 
that's better. So we just need to pull up to the left here and then straighten it. There we go. It sucks because we got to wait inside, dude. Waiting inside is no fun. All right, this is going to do it here. We're not on ice, so we're not going to slam into the dock like we did the other day. We're getting close. hit the dock all right we got a mark that we've arrived and shut the truck off and all that fun stuff see you guys here in a little bit all right guys so that was like the weirdest delivery i've ever had um so we basically dropped the trailer or we got unloaded but they literally had like a canine inside the facility like sniffing everything and i've never seen that before but they also made me sit inside wow um, they were unloading, so I guess that might be a reason I've never seen it before. Um, but we are headed to the yard in Joliet, Illinois. Um, we gotta make a left here and go down this road. I don't know how long, but then after we do that, we should be getting on the interstate. As we made it here to, I guess it's the CFI yard, but I think it's just like a common drop yard. So, uh, yeah, we're going to find out where all the other CFI trailers are and drop this right with them. And uh, I think what we need to do here is go this way and then go back around so we have a side side because nobody wants I'm probably better. Well, I mean, I am, I'm in this lot, but I'm going to throw my seatbelt on. I gotta call and see how uh, see how it's gonna work with uh, the Kansas City yard um, since they closed it. I gotta find out how that's gonna work with my personal vehicle. It probably won't, to be honest. drop this CFI trailer in a spot. Hopefully there's enough spots. Oh, is this one right here? Nope. Here's one next to this one though. That's gonna be kind of a weird back. We're gonna go for it though. Well, someone dropped their trailer in a CFI spot. Push it back over to the left here. And then we gotta give it some more right. Once our tandem's clear, that's how you know you're good. Hard right here. All right. Should be enough to uh, straighten it with the other. Not quite. Okay. So we're gonna pull up to the left here and cut a hard right. Oh, I thought the wheel was straight there, but it wasn't. Just 
just a little bit more to make it straight with that other trailer. Man, all right, hold on. We gotta pull up to the left here. To the right. And then back left. Now I'm not giving myself very much room, but <laughs> that's all right. It's just hard to like be straight with that other trailer. We got it now. I'm not gonna have a lot of room to drop this, but I'm gonna line these two trailers up right there, and we're gonna drop it right there. Hey, we can. I got my stuff on, so we can we can drop it right now on the GoPro. Heck yeah, heck yeah, buddy. You're gonna be quicker than that, buddy, bro. I got so much static electricity right now, it's not even funny. It's not even funny, bro. I didn't give myself very much room here, but... We got her in. And we don't need a lot of room to crank this. So. One more. It's about half an inch. And we're gonna go ahead and disconnect our lines. Like that. Bada bing. Bada boom. Make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe for future content, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Come on. Everything is A-OK -okay when you're riding with Jay. Keep those wheels turning and we do this every day. Backing up a trailer, look at all the roads I've driven. Come and ride with me. Yeah, let me show you how I'm living. Come on.